on that this is going to be another wig review um i actually found this um i think i was just on youtube um no maybe instagram and i saw this wig and i was like i wanted to try it and i tried another wig that has the same name but it's a different company different look but i got the janet collection uh d wig d I got this in a number two, and this is a transparent Swiss lace, 100% hand tie, and it's supposed to be HD lace. Okay, so y'all know I'm a little iffy about the HD lace, because sometimes it can be like super bright um, and not really be HD, you know? Um, so the specs on this wig is uh, they have a natural deep part in space. So it's only like, it's not like a full lace front wig. You just get that part where the uh, part is. Um, the temperature, the heat can, is safe up to 360 degrees. So, you know, um, and I also bought this, the D wig from wigtice.com. I'll definitely leave the information below. Um, I can't remember exactly what the price was, but I'll of course put it in my video, put it in the description box below. So let's get into this video, you guys. So you guys, I just want to get into this before I put this on my head. This looks like a lot of hair. Now, okay, let's just look. I don't kind of, I, I mean, I haven't tried it yet, but I'm just going off what I'm looking at. I just feel like this is a lot of hair. And me personally, like, I, I don't know. We'll see how it looks. I just want to get in. To the curls, and y'all know I'm a big curl lover. I love everything curls. Um, so let's just look. This is the lace, show. We got, of course, the three combs, two at the side, of course, one at the nape of the neck. Um, okay, of course, the, um, all right. Of course, we got the drawstring jaw, y'all know. And um, this is just how it looks. You get that little bit of parting space area and got some baby hairs. Hmm, doesn't look bad. Okay, y'all, um, let's just go in, let's get in close. I'm trying to use the combs that are provided on the side of the head and Um, y'all just, um, just from just putting this wig on already, the wig is big head friendly, y'all. I have a lot of space and I have inserted the combs that are right here. I put the comb on in the back. The drawstrings are already put in place and I feel like my head has room. Like, so let's just look at this hair of mine. Um, the hairline is pretty good. Like it's, you know, I would personally maybe go in and pluck it a little bit, but for some, for any of my beginners, I feel like you would be good. You would be safe with not even having to touch it. I am loving this. Honestly, I was a little skeptical because it just looked like a lot of hair and I didn't want to look like I had like curly fries, you know? <laughs> I didn't look like I had like curly fries, like too much. Look like a handful of curly fries. <laughs> and it's actually very like airy, I want to say, um, very light. Like you usually like with this much hair is like usually heavy and super hot. But this is, ooh, like, okay. This is what y'all come with. And I really, the lace, I just added a little bit of powder, but I probably, if I did not add it, would have been good to go. Um, I 
we try to get in closer yeah the hairline is i mean if you would like to make changes you could and if you didn't you will be just as fine um so i'm gonna go in and cut this lace off i'm trying to figure out if i want some baby hairs we'll see we'll see y'all <laughs> to be glue free spray or any gel because I just don't feel like it and I feel good enough that um I don't need to um if I wanted to make the wig tighter I feel like it would be secure enough for me to wear the wig um I'm probably gonna go in and make some baby hairs just a few sometimes I just don't feel like it sometimes I feel like it's not necessary but if you wanted to y'all do it okay I feel like, look at this lace, y'all. Just look at it. That looks good. Like, literally matching the skin tone, y'all. The HD lace. Y'all came through. Um, I don't have no complaints. Even the part, like, I thought I was going to have to do a little bit more. Um, but I'm loving this. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um... I don't know if I'm going to go in with some baby hair. So long. I may, y'all. Let me So, one thing I'm going to say that I don't like about this wig. I love this wig. But this is too much. This is too much. This is not even, like, realistic. Like, that's crazy. So, I am going to go in and do a little bit of cutting. Because I don't like all of this. Like, that's... It just looks too fake at this point. Like, I'm not with it. So, I'm going to go in and do a little bit of cutting. <laughs> to be like all flat up here and then just all big it looks kind of crazy so that's all i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna brush this down because i'm not doing no baby hairs that's it but and just be careful you don't mess up your curls you still want to have the curls intact i'm just going in a little part and that's it the lace is perfect, y'all. I went in with a little lot of body. I just sprayed a little bit on my, I just put a little bit on my hand. Literally just rubbed my hands together and just did a little bit of this. You might want to go in like with your fingers to like just separate them, uh, the curls a little bit because they can, some of them need a little bit of unraveling, especially like in the front. 
they tend to have, you know, the curls a little tight, so you might wanna take them out like that. Just be a little gentle. Um, and, you know, it gives you more, just a realistic look. Um, yeah, I went in and cut some more. As y'all can see, I definitely went and cut some more. I just felt like it was extremely too long and I didn't like it. It didn't look natural enough. For me, like, I like my girls to look natural. And I feel like it being that damn long and it's a wig, that it just looks too fake for me. And I'm, I wasn't feeling it. So I, and I'm five, five y'all. So that hair was like all the way down to my butt. And then it just li didn't look realistic. Like this looks realistic to me, for me. I mean, if you like it, then go ahead. But it just was not, it was giving me very much horsey, kind of like, just was not looking good. Um, and for this to be like, uh, what is this fiber? I mean, synthetic wig. This looks actually really natural, y'all. And I feel like over time, it's going to get, you know, more of the, you know, gets a little older and it looks a lot better. And I just feel like when you <laughs> wear this for a couple more days, it is really going to. Now, I'm going to tell y'all, let's go over the pros and cons. I kind of wanted to do it as I was filming because I really wanted to give you guys the real reaction. But number one, this, the D-Wig is freaking big head friendly, which is awesome. And it's awesome for everybody because, you know, if you have a smaller head, you can adjust the straps. And I love the combs on the side because I literally put the combs in. If you don't want to like glue it down and, you know, you don't have to love that the HD lace is. Do y'all see that? Y'all only see my cape because I didn't pull my cape all the way. But even look at the cape. Oh my god, the hairline, amazing. I just did not. I was struggling with my baby hairs though, so I just kept it simple. But I showed y'all earlier in the video the hairline was good, especially for beginners. Um, I just don't feel like you really need to, but if you want to, some people, you know. I mean, I feel like it's a curly wig, so how much of the hairline are you going to want to see? It's so big, you're not going to really care about a hairline. I feel like if it was like straight hair or it was like body wave or something, because, you know, but this is a big wig. It's not really, I feel like these type of wigs, are the hairlines are not really that important, but this really gives me more of a real life illusion. Like, I really feel like this is my hair, even though I know it ain't. I mean, it's not because I paid for it, but um, definitely love it. Um... Um, I, like I said, I went in with a little bit of powder um, just to be careful because sometimes these lace can be very light. Um, but love that. The only thing that I really did not like, you guys, was that it was super long and it just looked real fake to me. I didn't like that. That was like my only con. Um, the lace was good, pretty sturdy, not too thin, not weak. Like if I felt like I pulled on it too hard, I would poke a hole in it. It was really good. Um, the hair is amazing. It's very light and airy and it's not super heavy. The only part, that's why I cut it because it was just too much. But once I cut it, it made it even better. I feel like I could breathe in this. So um, definitely love Give it. this video a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe to this channel, y'all. Um, of course, we got some more videos coming. So let me know if you guys, if anybody has this wig, let me know in the uh, comment section below what you think about it. Let me know if you're going to buy it. Keep me up to date. Okay, let me know what y'all girls think. Um, I will see you in the next video, you guys. Bye.